One day in 1999, Zhang Jianrong, a taxi driver in North China's city of Taiyuan, found a baby girl who was abandoned in his car by two passengers. A note left in her clothing indicated that she was just three days old. At the time, Zhang and his wife already had a 15-year-old daughter, so their first choice was to send the baby to a local orphanage. But after seeing the poor condition of the orphanage, they changed their minds. People raise stray dogs and cats. Why not raise an abandoned baby? We couldn't part with her. Zhang and his wife officially adopted the girl, who they named Zhang Ting. She did well in school, and it seemed that her life was on the right track, until she was found to be suffering from uremia, a condition that can be a symptom of renal failure. We felt desperate. Why did this kind of a tragedy happen to us? The doctor was very honest with me. He said I would ultimately lose my daughter, as well as my savings. I was stunned. Zhang Ting had to undergo hemodialysis three times a week to treat her condition. The treatment was both expensive and physically exhausting. In the end, her dad decided to look into kidney transplants. Miraculously, Zhang and his adopted daughter were found to be compatible enough to allow for a transplant. Zhang then decided to give her one of his kidneys. Although many friends said 58-year-old Zhang was too old to undergo such a procedure, he insisted on going through with it. China View spoke to Zhang Ting before her Wednesday operation. They've raised me and now they are donating an organ to me. I can't thank them enough. After I recover, I will try my best to return their love. Many of those who have heard about Zhang's story have donated money to the family. The operation is said to have gone well, but both Zhang and his daughter are still being closely monitored.